Assalamu alaikum everyone. Today we will be looking at urease positive bacteria. But before getting into the video, I'd like to tell you guys that these videos are meant for educational purposes. Things and treatments may change with time. If I get wrong or miss anything, your input is always welcome in the comments section. Grab a pen and a notepad and let's get started. Urease positive bacteria. As the word urease shows that it's an enzyme because it ends with ASE, A S E. So those bacteria who have the urease enzyme are going to be urease positive bacteria. What's the function of urease? It converts urea to ammonia and carbon dioxide. Right. So, urease positive bacteria have that ability to convert urea to ammonia and carbon dioxide. This results in increased urine pH. Increased urine pH means urine will be more alkaline, right? So, we can call it alkalinization of urine. Here, I would like to take a moment to thank Picmonic for sponsoring today's video. Picmonic is an audiovisual learning platform that is tailored to assist the needs of medical students, physician assistants, doctors, nurses, and more. They've got valuable resources like video lectures, visual mnemonics, quizzes, study scheduler, and much more. We'll be reviewing urease positive organism in today's video from Picmonic, so stay tuned for that. And if you guys are interested in signing up on Picmonic, I've got you discount code MEDZOHROF and the link in the description. That will give you 20% off on your purchase. So what are you waiting for? Go sign up and enjoy your learning. Lecture outline. We are done with the introduction of urease positive bacteria. Now we'll be looking at the names of those bacteria. And then we'll have a Picmonic review of urease positive bacteria. And then we'll look at the urease test. Like what kind of test is this? And how many types of this test exist. Following are the urease positive bacteria. I do have videos on them. If you guys are interested, be sure to check out the channel. First one is Proteus, then we've got Nocardia, then Urea Plasma, then Helicobacter pylori, that's the famous urease positive bacteria. Then we've got Klebsiella, Cryptococcus, Staphylococcus epidermidis, Staphylococcus saprophyticus. Now let's have a look at urease positive organisms from Picmonic. In this Picmonic, we learn about urease positive organisms, illustrated by the story of U eraser positive erasing the symbol of peace in town. This one. Urease positive organisms are a group of organisms that can convert urea to ammonia and carbon dioxide. This is represented by a urambo, ammo and carbon dioxide molecules, these ones. The production of ammonia will result in the alkalinization of medium, which is most often urine. This results in an increased urine pH shown by an up arrow urinal pH scale, this one. Helicobacter pylori is the first of these organisms and is represented by a helicopter bacteria. This organism is most likely to be found in stomach. Next is Klebsiella, illustrated by a clubbing sea lion, and Cryptococcus shown by Cryptcock. Urea plasma shown by Urambo plasma TV, this one, and Proteus represented by Prometheus are the two more organisms that express urease. Nocardia is illustrated by a note card, this one, and Staphylococcus epidermidis is represented by a staph on epidermis histology, this one. The final urease positive organism in this picmonic is Staphylococcus saprophyticus, which is depicted by a staph sapphire. To recap, urease positive organisms are a group of organisms, I mean the bacteria we are discussing today, that can convert urea to ammonia and carbon dioxide. This will result in increased urine pH. These organisms include Proteus, Nocardia, Urea Plasma, Helicobacter pylori, Klebsiella, Cryptococcus, Staphylococcus epidermidis, and Staphylococcus saprophyticus. I have linked the urease positive organisms Picmonic PDF in the description. That is free. If you guys are interested, you can easily download that. And also, if you guys are interested, I've got you a discount code Medsohruf and the link in the description. That will give you 20% off on your purchase on Picmonic. So what are you waiting for? Hurry up and sign up. Now let's have a look at urease test. It's a procedure that identifies bacteria that can break down urea to produce ammonia and carbon dioxide. We've got two types of urease tests. 
One is rapid urease test and the second one is selective urease test. I'm not going to discuss these two tests here because they will be discussed in a separate video. I'll link it below in the description. And that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you've got any suggestions, feel free to leave them below in the comments. And also, if you want to connect with me on my social media, I've got my Instagram and Twitter, both with the handle Medzokrov. And I'll see you in the next video. Till then, assalamu alaikum.